We got so many ideas in the last video in the comments section that I had to actually put together a real to-do list. I couldn't keep keeping track in Notepad, so here we are. Look at all of these ideas. Guys, keep them coming. Put your ideas in the comments. Eventually, it will get added in-game, but first, it'll make its way to this to-do list, and when I start working on it, it'll get moved to the in-progress list, and when it's done, it'll get moved to the completed list, and you will see your idea in-game. <laughs> The first thing that I wanted to add before creating an item manager and other types of items was a heads up display to show what items you have available plus what item you have currently selected. As you can see in the top left, we have this nice UI that pops in when you press an item and it pops out after a couple seconds delay. And of course we have the tool gun which has its own sub menu as you can see on the right, it has a very similar effect. It pops in when you change the tool, it shows you what tool you have selected and you simply just scroll the mouse wheel up and down to select different tools. I'll give this a second to pop out so you can see how that looks pretty nice so far we have three different tools we've got the deleter which simply deletes a prop from existence we've got the welder which will weld two props together i'll show you an example of this we will weld these two cubes and pick it up with the fizz gun as you can see they are welded together and we have the destructor which does destroys a prop just like that. The welder has a secondary tool that you can unweld with. So if we go to our welder, we can right click and unweld. As you can see, these cubes are no longer welded together. We've got a gravity gun, which you can use to pick up objects and you can also throw them. And of course, we've got the stick, which is a melee weapon, which you can use to abuse your creations if you feel like getting physical. Up next are the ragdolls. I've added two models that are totally ragdolled. We're gonna spawn both of them right here. We've got a dummy model and we have this fat wrestler guy. You can pick him up by any joint and their limbs sort of just flop around. Ragdolls are totally compatible with fizz gun and welding. So you can freeze a ragdoll in space by any limb and he'll kind of just sit there and hang. And you can weld objects to ragdolls as well. Let's grab a sphere, bring it a little closer and let's weld this guy's head to the sphere and just like that his head is attached to a sphere the final thing on the in progress list is the improved fizz gun model which if you guys saw on my community tab i posted a screenshot of this gun that i, I personally don't think it looked that great that's why i posted the poll asking if you guys thought it looked great and the overwhelming response was no, I didn't look that great. So we have this new fizz gun model, which is just temporary. I think eventually I'm gonna try to find a couple different fizz gun models, but eventually we're gonna have something that is voted on by the community and that is going to be our fizz gun. That about wraps this up. The next video for UMod will have a few more things crossed off the to-do list. I do wanna get a build out for you guys to play and check out eventually. I'm not sure when that's gonna come, but it will come eventually. So keep an eye out for that. Press the like button and subscribe to support my channel. Every like, every subscribe, and every comment helps the YouTube algorithm promote my channel. So whatever you can do in that regard helps me grow. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one.